ring, which will not only, not only will it be like the Google Watch, but better. And one of the reasons that they don't mention, but I'll mention that they're doing this, isn't because it's an upgrade in technology from the watch. No, it's to condition people to permanently have technology on them so that it can be in them. Because think about it, the watch, the bracelet, just like the phone, is something that people are on when they're awake the entire day. They're on their phones. You can go out in public. You see these people sitting around on their phones like zombies. They can't be anywhere without being on it. When they sit in a waiting room, they're all on it. Nobody can even just sit. People are driving their cars, texting on the phone 24-7. Well, boop, boop, boop. not really 24-7 because when they're asleep, this technology is not on them. They're not sleeping with it glued to their forehead. The same goes with the watch, right? The watch is usually removed from the wrist. But what is something that people are used to sleeping with on their bodies? A ring, right? A ring, as in wedding rings. Some people sleep with other types of rings on them and jewelry. But people don't usually sleep with a watch on them. It might leave a little mark around your wrist if you have hair on your wrist. Uh, it'll probably, you know, itch a little bit. So you move to the ring. This is probably the last step because it's the only thing that you could literally, only body part literally where you would keep it on you at all times, prepping you for the technology to be with you 24-7, on you 24-7, to be in you 24-7. Now, before I show you the video clip of this device and the frightening type of technology that it is, I also want to note the privacy concerns that'll come with this. And don't be surprised if people use Apple rings as wedding bands as well in the future. You might say that sounds crazy, but guess what? So did the cell phone when it was first introduced. So did the notion of going out and having to have it on you at all times. That was a crazy notion. Now, like I've said a million times, people can't leave the house without it. If they do, they will turn around. If they're two hours away to get it, they cannot be without it. That'll be something with like this ring. You could see somebody proposing with an Apple ring or maybe using a wedding band, but then transitioning or having a wedding ring with this or, you know, even having it in, you know, diamonds put on it. Who knows, right? What they'll do from that standpoint. But what's interesting to note is that it'll also be a tracking device because we know now, obviously, with all the technology they're tracking, it's not a surprise. Recently, I even covered some of the things like the Apple tag, which people were sticking on other people's cars so that they can track them and monitor them and stalk them and eventually do something to them, such as rob their car, steal their car, or do something to the person and harm them, the person who drove the car, find out where they live, things like that, to stalk. This will, this will be perfect for people, couples especially, because you'll be able to track where your loved one is 24-7 because your, your rings will be connected to each other. That's right, as you'll see in the video clip here, you'll see how people are connected, how these things are going to link up with your devices. Insane stuff, but stuff that people say, this looks great, right? And I was even reading an article that just came out about it, where the person was talking about, or the company who wrote the article was talking about how, you know, the watch is a little tedious, it's a little bulky, that the ring would be an upgrade from the watch, because... You know, it's really bulky. It's hard to wear a watch now. Let's just get her. I mean, that's how they're doing this, right? The wallet to the ditch, to the phone, to the watch, to the ring. How about just, you know, something that you could put in you? Huh? Interesting, isn't it? No, not really. Frightening is the actual term. So track your spouse. And if they're, if you're questioning where they are, you don't know the address. Of course, it can lead to a fight. And of course, they don't want humans to be married and reproduce anyway and make children they don't want that stuff we see the data on that 24 7 when they constantly come out with data about how people aren't able to have kids anymore but we won't get into that this is about the apple ring the future of technology one step closer to being inside your body take a look